circumstance mm -hmm. leading up to that with the parade and everything yeah. like that, that's kind of part of the whole event. Well, yeah. they have to hope they have good weather there, but we also need to have good weather here for qualifying tomorrow with the Speedway. I think if we had to pick a better day, the better day, unfortunately, is going to be Sunday. So we mm -hmm. may see some adjustments from the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, especially if the forecast uh, develops how we think it will with rain a good part of tomorrow, especially the early half. This is live Doppler 13 radar showing the rain we're still tracking from Crawfordsville. Heavy at times across Montgomery County, north along 231 into Lafayette. We still have some rain in Frankfort and in Delphi. Also in our eastern viewing area, Richmond, south to Liberty, up into Winchester as well along 27. We're not completely done with rain chances, and we needed the rain. Some rain totals from our Weatherbug Network sites, just over four-tenths in Plainfield, about a third of an inch in Homecroft and Carmel. Kokomo, too, officially at the airport in Indianapolis, just over a half inch of much needed rain. 69 degrees right now. We have an east wind at 9. There's the rain total from today, 0.55 which is more than what we've had all month long. We got that in a matter of a few hours this evening. Today's high temperature, 73. It's the first time since the 8th of this month that we've been in the 70s. In fact, the last nine days were in the 80s, and you can see just how warm and how long the stretch of 80-degree temperatures were. That came to an end today with a high of 73. Mentioned the rain that we're still dealing with and more in the Saturday forecast. That's because the center of this storm system that we're tracking still spinning across the southern sections of Illinois. And it's going to take several hours before it moves far enough east of us that rain chances will end on Saturday. So here's what we're expecting. Future Track 13 shows the rain in place now. And because the storm system will still be overhead tomorrow, there will be off and on showers, especially the early half of tomorrow. That's noon. We should start to see it wind down late afternoon, early evening as this weather system finally moves east. Take your patience. Take the rain gear. If you're headed to qualifying on Saturday, midday temperature with still some rain around 71. Less coverage during the late afternoon hours with eventual highs in the upper 70s. We then track a complex of storms that if it holds together coming out of Illinois late Saturday night, early Sunday, brings with it the threat for some wind, windy conditions and a few storms early Sunday. That moves out. We get some dry hours Sunday afternoon, heats up the atmosphere, destabilizes the atmosphere, and we could have a few more afternoon storms on Sunday. Sunday, at this point, we get more dry hours than what we're expecting tomorrow, and it will be the warmer of the two days with a high of 87. Still the chance for a few storms around on Monday. Then we move into a dry pattern with high temperatures in the low 80s a good part of next week.